Hi, I'm Kyan. Welcome to Math in the World Around Us. Let's talk about the kind of shape that's made when two lines meet. That's called an angle. Angles can be big or small, but an angle like this is a right angle. It's the same size as the inside corner of a square or rectangle. That's correct, Kayan. And did you know that the people of India were one of the earliest to discover something truly incredible about triangles with right angles in them, which are called right triangles? Hey, are you paying attention? Okay. To understand this discovery, you must first understand that some numbers are special because you can create them by multiplying other numbers by themselves. These are called square numbers. Now, watch carefully. Here is a triangle with the right angle with sides that are 3 feet, 4 feet and 5 feet long. The squares of those numbers are 9, 16 and 25. But take a look at this. 9 plus 16 equals 25. We can also write the equation this way. 3 times 3 plus 4 times 4 equals 5 times 5. Super cool man, right? Mathematicians have developed an easier way to write square numbers. They put an adorable little 2 slightly above the number to indicate that it's to be multiplied by itself. See? This way can be written 3 squared plus 4 squared equals 5 squared. This doesn't just work on a 3, 4, 5 right triangle. You can prove this is true for every right triangle. Are you freaking out? So exciting. In fact, we know that ancient Egyptians used the same idea when building the pyramids to make sure that the corners were right angles. First class, man, first class. This equation is so mind-blowing that it has been named after a very famous mathematician of Greece named Pythagoras. These days, people call it the Pythagorean Theorem. But now you know a little secret. It was discovered long before Pythagoras. Goodbye, Kayan. Never forget. And remember, math is all around us if you just know where to look. Until next time. <laughs>